Okay, kiddos. Uh, that wasn't as easy as I thought. So, standard roof V8 matte black. Let's see what it looks like. Fresh out the box, untampered. And then let's see what they look like together. Okay. Standard roof V8 matte black. Um, it's worth pointing out actually that one of the things that people don't consider when they're deciding between gloss black and matte black or any of the other colours is that the matte black V8 is the only V8 which has the logo blacked out. So you probably, it probably, it probably doesn't actually occur to you straight away what's different about it until you, until you look at it for a while. But that's really the essential difference. That's why the matte black one looks so good uh, because you really can't see the logo. So standard and alongside it the black shadow. So the real differences are in the venting. The standard V8's got the old round vent bit Star Wars, uh, sort of 1980 look. This is much more futuristic, modern, streamlined on the black shadow. Uh, then one on top of the other, you can see the difference there in the in the uh, color of the of the the mount for the visor. Uh, the standard V8 has got the standard aluminium colored three pin washer system and the black shadow has got a black tin one. Uh, everything else is pretty much the same. Exactly the same clip system, exactly the same interior, exactly the same lining. There is no difference whatsoever. Uh, it's just that with the black shadow you get the option of the chrome visor as standard. It's actually, you're not really going to save anything. So if you wanted to buy the standard helmet, buy a chrome visor, it amounts to the same thing apart from the fact that these side pods are aluminium. Anyway, given the choice, most people are actually opting for the new helmet. So I think it's probably the venting, it does look ten times better. Part three, if I can find my screwdriver, is to actually put a chrome visor on both helmets and we'll see what they look like then side by side. <laughs> 